So welcome to the Particles Homework Booklet questions four and five uh, made I think the day after uh, the new Star Wars movie was released in Europe um, which apparently is a big thing. So we've got a nucleus of 9,4 be capturing a proton and emitting an alpha particle. What's produced? So let's take that one step at a time. We are uh, capturing a proton uh, which means we've got 9,4 be adding in the proton. That means I've got 9 plus 1, I've got 10. 4 plus 1, I get 5. So the new thing I make is 10, 5, x. We then um, emit an alpha particle. So we've got this new thing that we just made, 10, 5, x. That's going to emit the alpha particle. There's 4, 2, alpha. So we've got 4, 2, alpha. And that leaves from the 10. We've got 6 left behind. From the 5, we've got 3 left behind. So what we end up making is 6, 3, lithium. Then for question 5, we've got a radioactive nucleus emitting a beta particle, then an alpha particle, and finally another beta. What do we know about the final uh, about the final uh, nuclide. Well, what are we going to do? We start off emitting a beta particle. The effect of, uh, on proton number of the beta particle is to add one. We then go in and we have an alpha decay. The effect of an alpha decay is to take two off the proton number because two protons leave and then we've got another beta particle which again adds one to the proton remembering that in beta decay a neutron turns into a proton so overall we've added a proton number we've taken two off and we've added another one so that is going to leave us at the uh, proton number remaining unchanged in all that, of course, if we just have a quick think about the nucleon number, for the beta decay, that makes no difference to the beta, to the nucleon number in either case. The alpha decay is going to drop the nucleon number by 4. So now we need to, we've worked out what's happening, go back, see which of the options. And what we have got is an isotope of the original element. Same number of nucleons, different number of protons. I can't have the same element with a different proton excuse me, with a different proton number. Um, we haven't changed the proton number, so that's not the same. Uh, we could have a new element with a lower nucleon number. We do have a lower nucleon number, but we worked out that it is the same one. So it is A. Question 5 was A. So that was the Particles Homework booklet, questions 4 and 5.